I'm going to head over to the Beko <laughs> Kitchen. Mark, happy Easter. Happy Easter. Do you get a break? Uh, I've got a long weekend, yeah. Oh, my goodness, that'll be a first. But before you break, are you going to be making us a cheesecake today? This looks incredible. Well, I mean, it's classic. It screams at Easter. You know, we've got chocolate, we've got Cadbury's cream eggs, we've got caramel, and we're going to turn it into a cheesecake. It's going to be the best mm. thing you've ever tasted. OK, Mel said she wanted a big one. <laughs> she, she loves cheesecake. OK. OK. We so better eat it before we get to <laughs> Mel. True, that's right. <laughs> She's back. You've got to hide the food. <laughs> Thank you very much, Holly. Great to have you with us. We are in the Becco Kitchen and we've got a fabulous Easter sweet treat for this morning, which is fantastic. Uh, it's a cheesecake. Where did, this, <laughs> where did this inspiration come from? You know, like just like a week before Easter, you see all these uh, like crazy recipes on yeah. the internet yeah. and all over the place, and it's like, why don't we make that? Because nice. it looks so good, and Ooh. I think it looks good because it's got chocolate and caramel and different layers of cheesecake mm. and Cadbury's cream eggs on there. You can't, cream it's not eggs. Easter without cream eggs. Do you need all five of them? Uh, yes. Uh. Three for the recipe and two for me. Right. OK. <laughs> and did, did you need the chocolate that you had behind the desk here for uh, later? No, that's gone yet. Oh. I've already eaten oh, good. it. good. <laughs> because <laughs> I was nibbling away at that, and then all of a sudden I thought, he probably needs that. Anyway, so let's get right. going. What are we so doing, So double boil it. So we're going to melt the chocolate here. So double boil it. That just yep. means a pan of simmering water, put a, boil on, uh, a bowl over it so you create steam and it melts with that. So it's indirect um, heat. Eating. Cool. I've got some gelatin leaves here. So these are good. So these are really hard when they come out and you buy them, yeah. like hydrated or dehydrated. And yes. then uh, just put them in cold water, and then they'll just go like um, like uh, jelly. Gel jelly okay, almost. Cool. Yeah, yeah. And then so if you, you put them in hot water, they'll dissolve. So don't put them in uh, hot water. Yeah. So don't put them in hot water. <laughs> okay. You don't have anything. Right. I'm going to put you to work now. So bowl. Mm, work? What? That's why I got yeah. into TV just to hang around and talk, <laughs> mate. <laughs> walk. I work. Okay. Right. So you want to whisk that. Yeah. So in there, we're going to put a little bit. So that's cream cheese. A okay. little bit of vanilla extract in there. Mm-hmm. Thanks. And some sugar. All right. So you want to um, <laughs> just beat it together. <laughs> OK, yes. The journey is on Monday show to finish the cheesecake. <laughs> right, so you, but you need to get in there, you need to beat it, you need to make it nice and smooth and whip, uh, whipped up. <laughs> Obviously, <laughs> keep going. It's no, a busy recipe, I've got it. a lot to do. OK. All right, so, so you've got to do that. And then if you want to do this like a little bit easier at home, you can use the electric whisk. <laughs> And it does help as well if you if you take this out of the fridge like you know a little bit before, but you know you, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah you're halfway there now so just you know keep okay, beating cool. it. I'm, I'm getting there. Right, and then in this pot here I'm going to make the base. So base is very important. Biscuits and butter. Keep going. I okay, got yep right chef. Right, so I got some butter. So we're just going to melt the butter, and then we've got our biscuits here. So digestive biscuits, but you can use, you know, any of your favourite biscuits. You know, ginger biscuits works really well with cheesecake. Um, and then you just want to crush them up. So you can put this in a, a blender. You keep whipping, no lumps. Oh, jeez. So put it in a blender, or if you get a tray and a rolling pin that fits in the tray, you can just roll over them, and then you just get a nice crumb there. So that's going to be our base. So we're just going to mix it with some butter. You know, I mean, you can add anything to this. You know, customize this whole uh, the whole layers of the cheesecake. You can put spices in here if you want. How's that going for you? Going good. I was just thinking we've got lumberjacks in the studio. Maybe they should be doing this. <laughs> <laughs> they, they throw axes and stuff, you know. <laughs> They'll be really good at whipping up cream cheese. OK, we're getting there, though. All right, now that's all right. So that's good. So put that aside. And now you can oh, um, whip some cream. Oh, right, OK. Jeez, no you one are said it was going to be easy work, today. You? OK, cool. I'm going to put that back there so I've got some room. Right, so biscuits just go in a bowl. It's quite messy, this recipe. <laughs> oh, it's going to taste great, though. <laughs> All right, and then you're just going to pour the butter in here and then just mix it around. We'll just probably need a little bit more butter once that's melted. And then we've got a, we've got a tray here and we've got a mould. So, you know, you can select your moulds. I wasn't allowed to make small individual moulds today because uh, Mel's, Mel's back, back. and Mel's yeah. like, make a big one. Uh, so <laughs> that we've got was our, just for Mel. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is the individual one. Right, so you've got your butter in there, mix it all around, and then you just want to test it. You know, you can always add a little bit more butter if, um, you know, if you've put too many biscuits in there. If it's too crumbly, you need to add a little bit more butter. But if you just test it in the bowl and just sort of squash it, you can see it's all coming together. OK, nice. So get Good. that in the base, pop it in, make yep. sure it's nice and flat, pop it in the fridge for like 10 minutes just to set. The butter's going to go hard and make it set. And then we're ready to make our cheesecake layer. Nice work. 
Well, I'll keep whipping. <laughs> we'll come back, I think. <laughs> Rightio, we've done the basics with our cheesecake here in the Beko kitchen, and now we're going to turn this cheesecake into an Easter cheesecake. So how do we do that? That's it. Add chocolate to it. Add chocolate. So I've got a little bit of cocoa powder in there. Mm. Right, and then what we're going to do is we're going to split this now. So I'm going to make two different layers. So I'm going to put half into here. So this is our caramel, which yes. we just whipped up. Oh, and that uh, gelatin, what we had soaking. Yes. I've just melted that in like a, just a teaspoon of uh, hot water. Okay. And then popping all that together. Yum. So that's going to be one layer. Oh, yes. All right, so look at that. That looks great. Huh? That's amazing. All right, and then now pop your cream into here. Okay, cool. And then we're going to fold it in. Uh, okay, good thing I didn't whip it too much. You're very lucky, Mike. <laughs> Mark keeps saying, no, that's enough, that's enough. <laughs> Last time I turned stop, it into butter. Stop playing with it. There you go, is that enough? Yeah, yeah that's good. cool. So then just whisk that through. Mm -hmm. And then we've got this melted chocolate here, so you can pour a little bit of this chocolate into the cheesecake mix as well. And this is going to make our chocolate layer. Oh, okay, this here. So obviously you want to do this ahead of time. Yeah, that's it. Pour it in. Look <laughs> at that. <laughs> Bit more? Yep. Yep. Yeah, add it all. all. Don't, don't, be, all. don't be shy, yeah. Oh, okay. what, what are you going to do with the rest of the stuff in the bowl? Wow. Well, stupid question. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh, I've got some leftover go. chocolate, Dave. Okay, That's good. That's okay, you can keep that. Can I? Oh, great. Yeah. And then all you want to do now is you've got your two layers. Oh, it's hot. You just want to pour it into your mould. Look at that. Oh, easy. Okay, cool. So when you do this, pour your caramel one in first, and because of the gelatin in here, it's going to set. So you want to turn this back to the fridge. Mm -hmm. Just make sure it's all flat. Mm -hmm. Give it a little spread. Turn it to the fridge. Give it sort of half an hour or so. Once it sets, you can put the next layer on and then Yum. let that set. And you then some flavors. This is what you left oh, with. Here's one made earlier. Nice. Right, and now we want to uh, decorate, which oh, is the best. Which is the best there point. Turn it into Easter. I'm going to give this. That's give, it. I'm going to give this chocolate to Mel since she's been away. Okay. I'm going to do. Yeah. There you go. If there's any left. Yeah. <laughs> right. So you just get your Cadbury's cream eggs. This is probably the hardest part of the recipe is peeling these damn things. Let's then chop them. Yeah. Well, we're going to cut them in half. Yeah. And then we're going to pop these on here. Oh. Look at that. Get another one on there. That and just then looks what, delicious. And then what we've done as well is because you don't need all the caramel in your recipe for the cheesecake. Yeah. So we're going to put whatever caramel's left into a little piping bag. Yeah. So we've got some caramel. I've mm -hmm. saved some chocolate as well. And then oh. I'm going to go over the top. Good grief. Can never have too much caramel. Never too much caramel. And then I've got the chocolate as well. Oh. Pop some more chocolate on there, because you can never have too much chocolate at Easter no. time. And there you go, look at that. That is spectacular! Well done. I don't That's know where yours awesome. is. <laughs> yeah, true. I'll just lick the bowl, it's all right. <laughs> Excellent, and you can get the recipe at thecafe.co.nz. Um, as you've seen, nice, quick and easy to whip up, really, isn't it? Apart from waiting for it to set, you will be away laughing. Well done, Mark. Can't wait. Nice. Yeah. Let's keep it on this side of milk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Otherwise, we won't get any. Well, that's an Easter cheesecake, because it is Easter. <laughs>